Hi everyone, this is Purses and More and I'm back with another video. This is a Coach Small Satchel. I'm not sure the exact name of this bag. So let's go ahead and get started. As you can see, I have it packed pretty good. This is a relatively small bag, so I had to downsize a little bit. On the outside, we have these two handles here. I also have a Coach Charm that has the gold horse and carriage right there. I thought that was really beautiful. And of course the coach hang tag that comes with the bag. I have this pocket back holder from Bath and Body Works. This one has a cute little like wine bottle or champagne bottle on as an accent, this little charm. And then it just opens with a little snap there. And it's really cute and it works really well with this bag. What inspired me to carry this bag was a wallet that I purchased from Macy's recently and I couldn't believe it actually matched really, really well with this bag. I might switch into this little pocket bag holder, which is my little bunny. And she's got the little roses on her head. And I think for, it also has a little silver charm here, a little hanger hook here. And I thought this would be cute for Easter this coming weekend. On this strap here, it has the silver chain detail. And I have this one set on the middle setting, which is perfect for me for crossbody at the moment. There's seven adjustment spots and I have it on the fourth adjustment spot. And I really, really enjoyed carrying this bag. The only thing I would say is this strap is rather thin and it kind of digs into my shoulder a little bit. So I may make a, I have some pink leather. I may make a, a leather, like a wide strap thing that I can put this strap through. We'll see how that works out. I might make that now that I'm thinking of it, if I have enough leather for the pink. Let's go ahead and share with you what the bottom of the bag looks like. There's no feet. Here's the side. Here's the back and the other side. I just think that this is so cute. Let's go ahead and get into this one. This one, let's just show you. I have, I have it so stuffed that the sides don't necessarily button, but that's okay. When I take my phone, I can put it down inside one of these spots here. And then this is packed quite snugly so my phone sits in there and not in this one because I have my glasses in there but my phone fits nice and snugly in there um, or in the middle and I don't have to worry about it and then of course I have my keys here now let me show you this right quick before we get into the bag so I have this key holder I do have a pink one but I haven't switched into it for this particular bag just yet it's a Tory Burch that's the one that I have but I made this little leather key fob holder sort of um, out of black leather because every time I push this little button, the key pops out off the side. And because this bag is really small, or if I carry smaller bags, I have this kind of folder like this in my, in my pocket. It had been chilly here, so I put this in my coat pocket. And sometimes I just grab this and go. So literally... Every time I push this button, the, the key would pop out. So I thought I'd make this cute little key fob thing. Um, I had to improvise a little bit because I did cut the opening for the little buttons here a little bit too big. Um, and then so I decided instead of getting rid of the leather, I would just lace across there to hold it in there. Uh, I'm going to probably make a pink one or a different one uh, for that. I didn't find one on Amazon that I liked. So that is this little key holder. And if you're interested in this key holder from Coach, this one they do have at Macy's. This is in the cross grain leather. The inside looks like that. And you can put cards behind there when you have the two little pockets. I had to retire my other one a little bit because it is kind of beat up. So I decided to carry this one. All right. Let's go ahead and show you what I have in this bag. It has three open spots here, um, three available spots, I should say. 
So on this, in this spot here, I have my glasses. These are just my typical reading glasses. Then I have, now it fits down in there snugly, my little pouch here that has my wet ones. I have my, lo I put lotion in there so it doesn't open and spill inside my bag. And then of course the extra sanitizer. And that fits, I have to kind of squish in the corners, but it does fit down inside there, as you can see. And it does snap, it has the magnetic snap, but because I put my glasses in there, it doesn't snap uh, all that well. Okay, so that is there's nothing else in that pocket. In this back pocket, I just have my notebook with the little strawberries on it. And I have a little piece of paper in there that I need to um, take care of. I have these little this little Altoid case. Now there's not Altoids in here. I have my um, icebreaker mints in here, but this is small and compact, so I decided to put those in there. And I have my Kleenexes. And I have this cute little pen pouch here. This fits nicely down inside there, as you can see. Let me show you what I have in here. And that's what the empty spot looks like there. So in this little pen pouch, I got this quite a while ago from Amazon, I think, I think it was Amazon. In here I have band-aids, my headache medicine. I have a pink one like this, but I have not switched into that one. My Burt's Bees pomegranate, my Palmer's cocoa butter, some hair ties. My pencil, pen, my Lysol spray, tied to go pen, and this cute little emery board um, travel thing. I'm letting my nails grow, so uh, I have this just in case. I'm gonna put these all back in there. All right. And I think that's all I had in this little cute little pouch. And that's that. Then let's go ahead and share with you what's in the middle compartment. It has a nice opening zipper. And as you can hear, the magnets find themselves for those little clips. All right, so on the inside here, I have my a little compact charger. This just has the little spots there where you can plug in and it lights up I'm down to one little bar there as you can see I mean yeah so I gotta charge that and that's pink obviously this is the wallet that I was talking about so I just bought this at Macy's not too long ago as you can see the pinks aren't exact but it's a good match the canvas is the just about the same color and the pink um, it is a, lot, a little bit lighter, but because this one's probably, maybe because this one's older, I don't know. But I think it looks really nice uh, to go along with this bag. On the back of this wallet, there is a slip pocket here, or a zipper pocket. It has the information for this wallet. I'll just share the information with you. And I got this one from Macy's. And they had it on sale, uh, or else I wouldn't have bought it. So... And then you open it up and there's a, I have a gift card in the front there. And then I have, there's a spot, opens up like that. This is a wind wallet. And um, there's a spot for cards. There's a spot up here too. So I have cards in there, cards in there. There's six credit card slots and then there's a spot for cash. I really like this wallet and the leather on the inside is really nice and smooth. And it snaps good and it has a silver hardware. On the website, on Macy's, it says it has the gold hardware, but it doesn't. It's the silver. It shows silver. All right. So the next thing I have is this little case from Coach. And it has the silver hardware as well as the silver stamping. And I thought that would look nice with this bag. This is actually a pill case I bought, and it came with the three little bottles. But I took the bottles out so I can use this as in my tech pouch. It has my wired ear things, a lens wipe. I put my clippa in there. 
and then the information for this little item here and that's the information now i bought this second hand off of Macari or poshmark because i thought the pink was really pretty and that was a while ago that i bought this so let's go ahead and put this in there again And then I have my change holder that I made. And I have this Anushka little pouch. And it has some pink accents there. And I wanted something small. There's a string in there. I wanted something small for my cards. So I have some extra cards gift cards and what have you, and so I have cards in there. And I thought that would be a nice little pouch to put in there. Okay, so this is what the inside looks like. It's rather big and it's nice and pink, so you can see what you have in there. So as I carry this, I always Tetris my things. That way I know exactly where they are. And just show you how I put this all in here. Just fits all nice down, nicely down inside there, which is very convenient. Sometimes whenever I move things around, I find that I can position things a little bit easier. So let's go ahead and put this. And when you fill up the outside pockets, it does push on the in, on the, this middle pocket. So if I weren't going to put anything on the outside, I'd probably have a little bit more room on this um, in this middle. Here, but that's okay. All right, let's just share with you what this looks like. I know I did before. All right, let's go ahead and put everything in there. And it doesn't bother me that these that the magnets don't close when I have all the stuff in here because it's a relatively small carry and it's next to me if i carry it uh, on the crook of my arm like this no one can get it in there if i carry it cross body it's literally right up against me so there again no one can get in there and if they can they're a little bit they're way too close there we go and then my keys i'll either put them in my pocket or i can lay them on the top I don't have to bend that, I can just lay it on the top like that. Or, if I move these little L-toids, I'll show you. I can put these down inside here, just like that. And then my little L-toids can go in here. I don't necessarily have to take my glasses with me. Just wanted to show you that those would fit. There we go. And that's what this looks like. Just like that. And of course, when I I can zipper this up and it doesn't change the shape at all. And I have the ability to put my phone, which I'm filming on right now, down in this little spot here if I don't want to put my mints. Alright, so there you have it. This is the bag I'm carrying currently, and I'll probably switch out. After this weekend, I haven't decided if I'm carrying this this weekend or not. I may, since it's Easter, um, but we'll see. And as always, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like my content, please be sure to subscribe, give me a like, and share. And as always, I hope you enjoy your week. Have a great weekend, and I will talk to you all soon. Thanks for watching. Bye!